Hi, we are going to see whether cosecant is greater than cot or cot is greater than cosec. We will take a right angle triangle. This is a right angle triangle and this is a right angle that is 90 degrees. The side opposite to is uh, called C and the other two sides are A and B. Theta is the acute angle. It will always be less than 90 degrees because total sum of the angles is 180 degrees and 90 degrees is this angle. Therefore, some of the other two angles is 90 degrees. Therefore, each angle should be less than 90. Now, cosecant is defined as hypotenuse divided by opposite side. That is C divided by A. And cot is defined as adjacent side by opposite side. That is B divided by A. Now, in a right angle triangle, greatest angle is 90 degrees as I told you right now. And uh, therefore, the side opposite to 90 degrees is the greatest. C is the greatest of all the sides. In other words, hypotenuse is the greatest side. C squared is equal to A squared plus B squared, that is Pythagorean theorem. Using that also, we can say that C is greater than A and B. C is greater than A and C is also greater than B. Now, we will forget about this triangle and then apply this formula and then prove that cosecant is always greater than cot. Cosecant is hypotenuse divided by opposite. Cot is adjacent side by opposite. So, cosecant is C divided by A and cot is B divided by A. We know the denominator is always same. Both for cosecant and cot, the denominator is same. And the numerator, C is always greater than B. We already know. Therefore, C by A will always be greater than B by A. And therefore, cosecant is always greater than cot. C is greater than B. And therefore, cosecant is greater than cot. I hope uh, this convinces you. Uh, that uh, cosecant is always greater than cot for all values of theta. Right? Thank you very much.